Yeah, that's just right. We can tell you that for sure. I got to tell you that community is still outraged about what happened over on MLK and Malcolm X just last week. And police here at the 7th District, they have their hands full, not only dealing with Naya's murder, but also several other crimes, as you mentioned before, as Naya's family and community members are begging for help to get whoever killed her off the streets. Now, D.C. police announced just this week that they found the car they believe to be connected to the case, but so far no one is in custody. Naya died shortly after someone drove that car through this intersection and fired multiple gunshots. Those who knew her described her as a sweet girl who was full of life and loved to dance. A community organization called Guns Down Friday. They're partnering with a young local rapper to host a peace walk at 11 o'clock this morning. They're calling for an end to gun violence and asking for the community's help in getting justice for Naya's family. I see this so often um, when someone is killed, the community comes together, um, we rally and and after that, nothing is done. Um, and it's it's always the uh, people like around my age. Um, so to see a young man um, want to get involved in the community, someone who uh, doesn't do that often, it was just a beautiful thing. You know, why do you feel like this time may be different, that this may be a start to some real change happening? It's the young people that are that are doing these crimes. So you know, I, I feel like it's the young people who can answer, you know, what to do. Now, again, that Peace Walk is going to be at 11 o'clock this morning. It's going to start down on MLK and Atlantic Street in Southwest. Those demonstrators will then march up MLK right to that same corner where those five people were shot and where Naya was killed. And uh, Annie and Allison, I got to tell you, the game changer here, according to community organizers, again, is that this event is being organized by young people uh, to also reach out to their peers to hopefully prevent this from happening again.